This is Aelinar, the city of the gods. We are in the research center. You will meet with Harita, goddess and advisor of the immortals. There is no one on Aelion more wise and judicious. Well, it was my pleasure. I hope I will be hearing about your glorious feats. Welcome to Aelinar. I take it you had a pleasant trip. I am Harida. I will help you settle into your new life. into realms unknown. This power will pass on to Aelion's most worthy daughters and sons for as long as our bloodlines endure. Immortality is bestowed on you to protect our world. Destined to wield immense might and great authority, Perhaps one day you will be the one to take Eli's place. Remember to use your new powers wisely and with kindness. But to do that, you must first learn to control them. I know someone who can help you with that. You should talk to Flavius. He is no ordinary god. His vocation is science, but don't let that discourage you. He is a miracle worker in his own way. He is waiting for you. Now go! Every time I hear there's another immortal, I wonder why it isn't me. I wish I could visit the training hall. It would be nice to feel like an immortal. Even if it's just for a few minutes. A rookie! Hello. Liking immortality? Not getting to your head? Oh, my manners. I'm Flavius. I'm trying to advance science here while others are waving their swords. Of course I'm serious. Aside from me, no one's even trying to understand how things work in this world. Oh, right. This is my holographic form. No time to flit about. And there's so many immortals nowadays. Just so much to do. Right, back to business. Well, what are we waiting for? That transport capsule? You're getting in. I'll join you in the training hall. The hall's completely virtual. I've been doing all of our training here, ever since my lab was nearly destroyed. First, you'll need to pick a class. I'll show you how. Pick an available class, and you'll learn its basic abilities. How about that for a miracle of science? 
Of course. You can always change your class at any time. In a tricky situation, you have the Argus system to offer you advice. And of course, I invented it. Paladin is a melee fighter. Average damage, but high... Remember, you're a Paladin. Use your combo attacks. What you see now is a pack. These enemies are weak on their own, but a group of them can be extremely dangerous. Eliminate them using a of effectability. <laughs> Enemies that are strong, but few in number, should be killed one by one. Use abilities that inflict significant damage to a single target. Sometimes you can avoid damage. Take a closer look at the enemy. Some attacks take time to execute. You can evade them. until I fix everything. Did you like it? I don't normally hand out the divine form. It's not even in this training course, but that was an emergency. Someday, 
you'll be able to use it without my assistance. In the real world, and not just a virtual space. Oh, it's nothing. Do your best. And the desired results will follow suit. There are many troubles on Aelion, and the most crucial one is invasions. Go fight. Go save lives. Go make friends and gain more followers, and you will eventually become strong enough to take the next step and become a junior god. I am beginning to sound like Corita. That's it for now. You can return to the Divine Observatory or wherever you need to go. You can stay if you like, but I can't promise any more fun. Excellent choice. Each combat school is more than just a set of skills. It is a special path, a philosophy. It is time for you to learn about the mission of Aelion's gods. Come closer to the model of the planet. Listen. Do you hear that? Millions of voices are calling to us for help, begging us to save them, here in the observatory. Their prayers reach our ears. We are gods, but not almighty. But it is in our power to save lives, eliminate threats, and offer hope. Go. Aelion is waiting for you. Immortals are needed on Dankit Island. This mission will be your first. Find out what happened. Do whatever is necessary to accomplish that. 